各位亲，昨天呢就应该结束的法网男单决赛，因为雨儿推迟到了今晚，而创造历史的悬念和最顶级的对决也留到了这一刻。昨天休战时，两人战至第四盘，德约科维奇局分二比一领先。不过今天一上来，小德就遭受打击，这次击球失误让他悔恨不已。丢掉这一分，小德随之也丢掉了自己的这个大结局。这场比赛对两人来说都是改写历史的一场。如果德约科维奇夺冠，他将成为四十三年来男子网坛第一个连夺四大满贯冠军头衔的男单选手。如果纳达尔获胜，他将成为历史上第一个在罗兰加洛斯七夺男单桂冠的选手。对胜利的渴望让两人多次上演精彩的回合，各自爆发，成为此后场上的主旋律。但俗话说好事多磨，两人想要夺冠，要面对的何止是强大的对手，还有巴黎善变的天气。这一盘纳达尔五比四领先之后，巴黎天空又飘起了小雨。好在这一次大家没有等待太久，休整几分钟之后，两人又各下一局。在关键的第十二局，纳达尔成功破发，最终以七比五赢下了这一盘，大比分三比一，成功卫冕。Privilege to be in this position for the first time ever in, a, in the finals of Roland Garros. I enjoyed this match very much. Rafa was a better player, and、uh, you know I, I hope to come back next year and play even better. Thank you. It's a special day for you because you beat Bjorn Borg record with seven wins. What do you think about it? How do you feel? Well, for me, it's a really honor, no. But anyway, for me, the most important thing is is this tournament, no. For me, this tournament is probably the the most special tournament of the world. And for me, be back here in this center court playing another final, and having this trophy with me is something unforgettable. And I am really, really emotional. And you know,、uh, it's probably one of the more special moments in my career.